Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. As we all know that PM Narendra Modi is in US and there are many deals that will be signed between US and India during his visit. The most important of all is going to be deal for manufacturing GF414 engines in India which will power LCA Mark II, AMCA Mark I and Ted BF fighter jets. The memorandum of understanding for the manufacture of GF414 engine will be signed tomorrow between India and US. It is likely that technology transfer will take place in phases with 80% of the value added to the engine occurring in India within three years. While India is on the verge of signing the historic deal for GF414 engines, ADA and HL is all geared up for development and production of LCA Mark II fighter jet. As per the reports from Hindustan Times, HL is ready for the upcoming challenge as the PSU will focus only on manufacturing the G engines as no less than 500 aircraft engines have to be produced in India. HL Bengaluru as well as Nashik Division may be tasked to take up the job and start production in collaboration with G. While ADA under DRDO is confident that it will deliver Mark II on time, the pressure will now be on HL to energize the workers of PSU to meet the challenges ahead. Even as the engine will have to be produced by GHL, the government may think of a special purpose vehicle to produce Mark II fighters to meet the deadlines of Indian Air Force. HL has planned to roll out the prototype of LC Mark II by the end of year 2024 and commence production by 2027-28. LC Mark II is going to be state-of-art, multi-role, all-weather supersonic fighter aircraft. It will be 4.5 plus generation aircraft with long range and endurance and equipped with contemporary systems, sensors and smart glass cockpit. It has network-centric warfare capability providing competitive edge through networking of geographically dispersed forces along with multi-sensor data fusion presenting a unified warfare scenario with advanced sensors like AAC radar, IRST, unified electronic warfare suite and missile approach warning system. LC Mark II is going to be much more capable than LC Mark I and other single engine fighter jets in its category. LC Mark II will have maximum takeoff weight of 17.5 tons with 11 hard points where it will be able to carry 6.5 tons of payload. It will have internal fuel capacity of 3.3 tons. The Minas 2000 under operation in Indian Air Force has maximum takeoff weight of 17 tons with 9 hard points where it can carry 6.2 tons of payload. The aircraft has internal fuel capacity of 3.1 ton. At the same time, the Saab Gripen E has maximum takeoff weight of 16.5 ton with 10 hard points where it can carry 7.2 tons of payload and the aircraft has internal fuel capacity of 3.4 tons. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.